Hi, my name is Anthony. Today I'm going to do a long-term report on the Kimco Racing S125. I've been riding this bike for the past two months, and I'm going to tell you how this bike rides on the road and on the track. On the road, this bike is a really agile scooter. Its ergonomic is really comfortable for short commutes, not necessary for long commutes. It has a really nice and plushy rear passenger seat. It's really user friendly. It has a really linear, smooth engine, really aggressive brakes, and a really big lean angle for a stock scooter. On the track, this bike handles amazingly. It has a really good lean angle. It's really predictable when you're entering a quarter and really good brakes that doesn't fade really helps on the track. With the help from Gears Suspension's rear shock and front fold, it really exploits the potential of the scooter. I could push harder into the corner and open up my throttle earlier at the apex, I can really predict when the scooter is going to slide while braking really hard or leaning really over the limit of the scooter. This scooter comes stock with a dual shock system at the rear and the single shock system is optional. I personally like the single shock system because it's more crisp and precise when I'm changing direction at the track. It also helps with the stability when I'm braking really aggressively or on the throttle really early. The front fork system is a massive improvement over the stock front forks. It's, it gives me more support and more confidence while braking really hard, especially with the really aggressive brake system that they made. A, front, a decent front fork is a necessary option for this scooter. What I have here is Gears' front fork emulator. The oil still flows in from the top and comes out from the bottom. But what's so special about it is the valving system on it. It has a high and low speed valving, which is controlled by shims. When the oil flow rate is really high, the shims will open up and let the high let more oil flow through the valves, and when it's when the, when the oil is flowing at a slower rate, it will just go in from the normal holes, just like stock. You can look at the diagram over here, which shows you what I just talked about. At a slower flow rate, the oil would just flow in from the existing holes and come out from the existing holes. And when the oil rate, oil flow rate is at a really high speed, the, the shims that covers the valve will open up and let more oil flow through the valves. Overall, I really like the handling of the scooter. It handles amazingly. It gives me confidence while riding. I would definitely recommend you to try out the Kimco Racing S125. Thank you for watching my video. I'll see you next time.